Well, hello again, Fight Fans, and welcome to another edition of The Speed Bag. Today, a little segment I like to call, You Have No Idea How Much We Still Need You. Now, this one goes out to former UFC welterweight champion George St. Pierre, who popped up in an interview with a French-Canadian news outlet recently to, of all things, voice his support for a former rival, Mr. Nick Diaz. As in the same Nick Diaz who's currently holding down a five-year ban courtesy of the Nevada State Athletic Commission for his third failed marijuana test. Now, there are a couple surprising things about St. Pierre stepping up to support Diaz. One is that they had a pretty bitter back and forth before their fight in 2013. I mean, you might recall that was the fight that got GSP to embrace his dark side. It's also the one where on a pre-fight conference call, he lashed out at Diaz and called him an uneducated fool and then attempted to explain the concept of passive income to him, which was priceless, I think we can all agree. But the other thing that's surprising is how much GSP's voice still matters. I mean, I admit the minute I saw that GSP had come out to, to speak out in favor of another fighter, in support of another fighter, I had to click on that thing. I mean, that, that was news, and it felt like it really mattered. Which is weird, since St. Pierre hasn't fought in almost two years, and it doesn't seem like he's gonna come back anytime soon, maybe not ever. Which makes you realize maybe this is the kind of guy we really need in MMA right now. A guy who left the UFC on his own terms, under good standing. A guy who you really can't say too many bad things about. A guy who could arguably lay some kind of claim to convincing the UFC to get involved with enhanced drug testing through USADA since he said he wasn't going to come back until they got that problem taken care of. Here's someone who can still speak to us and speak to the powers that be in this sport. And he doesn't need anything from anybody. He's not beholden to anybody. You can't punish him if he says something you disagree with. The powers of this sport can't really get to GSP anymore. He can say what he wants, and he's a pretty reasonable guy. I mean, coming out in support for Diaz, who, let's face it, probably wouldn't do the same for GSP if the roles were reversed, that shows you what a class act a guy like St. Pierre is. You know, we need a guy like that. We need a, a fighter advocate who has been there, and yet who isn't susceptible to the powerful forces that might seek to mold him and push and pull him one way or another. It's weird because you'd think that the best years of St. Pierre's career would be the ones he spent in the octagon, that that would be the most valuable contribution he could possibly make to the sport. And it still might be, but outside the cage, the voice he can still bring to discussions like this, you have no idea how much we need that right now, George St. Pierre.